for Erin and Ryan. That story began when they worked together at the Sainsbury's in Gurick. They quickly became friends and most Saturday nights saw the two of them and their workmates head to the cat house in Glasgow for a night out before getting the party bus home at 4 a.m. As time went on, Erin found herself actually looking forward to going to work so she could see Ryan and our two Gillians, of course. It was clear that Ryan and Erin were becoming more than friends. And Ryan says he knew from early on that Erin was the one. To my wife Erin, I promise you that for the rest of our lives, I will love you, I'll cherish you, and I'll do absolutely everything in my power to make you as happy as you've made me. My big brother Ryan has always been my closest friend and we've always been at each other's side through thick and thin and that's what big brothers are for. So through the good and the bad there is nobody on this planet that I'd rather have by my side except you Megan, that'll give me a bother later. You know, <laughs> um, <laughs> but I think you've struggled to find a nicer guy than my brother Ryan and he's done a bloody good job finding a woman like Erin who's willing to actually marry him I would think. <laughs> Before this moment, you've been many things to one another. Acquaintance, friend, companion, lover, dancing partner, and even teacher. For you've learned much from one another over these years. Today, you shall say a few words that take you across a threshold of life, and things will never quite be the same between you. For after these vows, you shall say to the world, this is my husband, this is my wife. I, Ryan McFeely. Accept you, Erin Foley. Accept you, Erin Foley. In marriage as my lawful wedded wife. In marriage as my lawful wedded wife. I, Erin Foley. Accept you, Ryan McFeely. Accept you, Ryan McFeely. In marriage as my lawful wedded husband. In marriage as my lawful wedded husband. now my most pleasant duty, Ryan and Erin, to declare that you are married and to pronounce you husband and wife. You make it! It's hard to believe that they've been together for seven years and I can honestly say that I've actually never seen him happier. Not that he was depressed before, but you know, he was, you know, he's, he's happier now. Um, so they've already carved a lovely life together, those who have been to see a lovely new house that they got earlier on this year and they'll have many more happy years to come.